how's it going, people of Earth and beyond? <laughs> Wherever you're watching. I don't know, the space station may be watching this. I, I, yeah, who knows? Joe here in the workshop on a Wednesday. By the way, this is National Golf Day. And as a lot of you know, I'm a big amateur golfer. And I love to play as much as I possibly can. That You know, benefits to that exercise, uh, relaxation, you know, take stress off and all that kind of stuff. So I love it. And plus the game I, I, I do love. So if you get to get out today and play, I'm trying to get out this afternoon after a little work here in the workshop today. Uh, something I haven't been doing, I need, I need to do more often, is to take a, a block of names from my from my uh, list of guys who have uh, ordered or who've received pipes or uh, making pipes for, and just want to say thank you. And if, I, if I've started too late and didn't get you before, let me know and I'll say hi to you on, on the video. Uh, Craig, who I made a Devil Ants for here not too long ago. Uh, Donald uh, did a great Wormwood poker. Love those. Uh, Dustin, a smooth uh, pocket poker. And that was really cool. I'm going to add that to the to the mix uh, on uh, on those things that you order on my order page. Those things you order, the pipes that you see on the order page. <laughs> yeah. um, let's see. Corey got a banded stubby Dublin and a black Sleepy Hollow, the original black Sleepy Hollow. That's that's the way I originally made it when Justin Dagner ordered one. Um, Justin, J Justin, Jason Dagner. I've got uh, I've got uh, golfers on my head. Jason Dagner uh, of Dagner Pipes fame ordered one when I first started. Gosh, back six seven years ago. Uh, let's see. Uh, Caleb's got a Dagner Slayer. Speaking of Dagner again, coming. Uh, Felix, we're going to be doing a Devil Ants for you. Lewis, a second generation Mad Hatter. Derek, a fireman billiard. And I've got more down the list that I'll mention. Uh, a little bit later on, but uh, those are the ones that are uh, either I have just made or are coming up and continue. Thank you very much for your business. I really do appreciate it. Those of you who like my versions of custom handmade pipes, there are other great pipe makers out there, and some of them a lot more intricate detail and everything, but the prices are also a little higher. Uh, mine, I hope, are in that good category where you feel good about getting a something that's that's made just for you, uh, rather than made in some factory somewhere and put on a shelf and you take one down and they never know who got it. I know who gets my pipes, and that's uh, that's a really cool feeling. Uh, also, I want to thank Ben at uh, TobaccoPipes.com. Now, uh, I do know that he gets a few from time to time, and uh, just uh, finished up uh, sending him uh, some pipes here over the last few weeks, and they've got some pipes. So the, the difference is for them is that those pipes are available now. So if you go on their website, tobaccopipes.com, and you want to, to get a pipe available now, there's no waiting there. It'll cost you a little bit more for the, the uh, advantage of not having to wait. Uh, for me, when you order one through my website at uh, www.jocasepipes.com, uh, you will have a wait period, but it's because you're in line with other guys who have ordered custom pipes, but you'll get something that was specially made for you. I do things like I can put your initials on it if you want your initials on it. Uh, you just have to let me know about that when you order. And uh, you can uh, you know, have the colors that you want to pick out, type of rustication you, you can pick out on, on the pipes, but you go to joecasepipes.com, uh, click on the the order custom pipes, it'll take you a pay, to a page where I have some suggested pipes right there. Or if you have a pipe that maybe you have seen, I've been working with a guy actually uh, from Russia <laughs> uh, who's been emailing me back and forth and he's got pipes that he's seen that he would wonder if I could make a pipe like it and we've been back and forth on, well, this is what we're doing so forth and so on. Uh, and we could we could work on that. Uh, you can you can write me. You can send me an email. By the way, my email address has changed. This is my new email address. It's JoeCasePipes at gmail.com. JoeCasePipes at gmail.com. Quite frankly, um, the uh, the the folks and I won't mention their name who have the domain and everything wanted to charge me an outrageous price to renew 
my, my email addresses and I just said to heck with it. I'm going to go with Gmail and people can find me there. So it's joecasepipes at gmail.com and that gets to me. Uh, so there you go. If you got questions about a pipe, you can send me an email. If you want to just go straight to the website and order, you can do so. And man, I just love to make a pipe for you. All right. That's it. That's all for right now. I'm having a good morning cup of coffee and getting ready to bear down on a pipe right now in the workshop right here in good old Nashville, Tennessee. God bless you all. We'll catch you next time. Thank you.